What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Motor WordPress Teams and in today's video gonna learn how to embed Spotify, music, audios, podcasts or even playlists into our WordPress website for free. So I'm gonna give you two ways to embed these two alternatives, one without plugins using the codes and one with plugins without using codes, okay? So let's get this started, but before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button like this video and share this content with a friend of yours who have no idea how much that helps us because we bring daily videos about WordPress, SEO, plugins, optimizations and many many more topics not just internet on our site's favor. So let's get this started. First thing to do is locate the song or the playlist or the podcast episode that I would like to embed. In my case it's the Back in Black, okay, this song for ACDC. So I'm gonna find a page almost like this one on your Spotify app. And next to the core icon, you're gonna be able to see this more options button right here, these three little dots. Click on it. And right here, we're gonna be able to see the share button. We're gonna need to find the share. We have two options to share, copy song link or embed track. First of all, I'm gonna explain how to embed the track, okay? So click on it. Now the Spotify gonna generate you the code and the visual version of the code. So here is how your site gonna looks like, how the music track gonna looks like. You can choose the color. I think the first one's better. You can change the size. In the case I don't need it. And the proportion, okay? So after this, you can show code or just copy the code. Here is the code generated from Spotify. Code copied. Now let's move to our WordPress dashboard. Find the place where you would like to embed this song, this podcast episode. Okay, so after I gotta click on in my case, gonna be into posts, add new. Okay. Now we're gonna click into this plus button right here to add a block and find a, an option, a widget called HTML, the custom HTML. Click on it, now place the code and if you preview, you're gonna be able to see the music, the music track embedded. Simple, easy, works great, okay? The same happens for playlists, for podcast episodes, okay? And we're gonna be able to see a result like this. Of course, we can, for example, apply this into a column layout. So, imagine that we want to embed two tracks. We're gonna need to call two custom HTMLs and enter the code right here. And if you preview into the real page, you're gonna see things like this: to embed a music, another music, a playlist, or another playlist. Okay, and it is easy, right? But what if you do not want to place codes on your site? You want to place only links to make, to make things easier? Completely possible. Let's go back to Spotify. Let me close this tab. Go to the three little dots, find the share option and copy the song link, okay? Now I'm gonna move to my WordPress dashboard, review the left sidebar of menus, over my mouse, over plugins and click on add new. Into the upper right corner of my screen, next to the keyword, into the search plugins, we're gonna type embed, just like this. And this is the guide that we are looking for, the embed press. Click on install now. Click into the activate button. That's gonna redirect you to the plugins list, a list where we can see all of the present plugins on our site. After this, we're gonna move to the post where I would like to embed my song. And now click into the plus button to add a new block. But instead of searching for custom HTML, we're gonna search for embed. And the guy that we're looking for is this guy right here, embed press. Now we're gonna place the song link that we did copied on Spotify. Click on embed. And here is our song. We can change the widget and the H from the 
right sidebar of menus and we can update the page to save the results. Same thing as previously, you can always apply this into a column layout, into your sidebar, into your footer. Another important part of this when you're using the plugin, it's the fact that if you go from the left sidebar of menus on the WordPress dashboard next to appearance into embed press, move to sources, select audio, here is Spotify, click into this gear icon, right here we're gonna be able to change the dynamic player background color from black and white or from dynamic. If you move to sources once again, you can see all of the current options that this plugin offers to embed content from. And of course, if you go to general, you can change some default options. For example, iframe e widget, iframe e H, and other options for PDF. And it is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. Don't forget to check out our Borders WordPress plugin to gain widgets, elements, templates and tools to build up your site using Elementor or Gutenberg. Or Enzu WordPress team, the best free WordPress team that you can install on your site to customize it in the way that you want. Or Growth.net platform, a place where you can promote your blog. You can submit your blog right here to receiving and publishing guest posts and connecting with a growing blogging community. Or sites.gallery, that is a place where you can promote your site, your landing page, your app design, your game, all for free. You can get awarded, promote your site, and get listed to gain a link right here. And as a final Nazi, in the case that I want to go premium while you're doing your WordPress websites, go to visualmoto.com, purchase the Visual Moto Pass, and unlock full access to our entire template library with hundreds of pre built websites that you can import with a single click, in addition for premium blocks, assets, templates, plugins, themes and many, many more things to create the site of our dreams. And it is. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I see you tomorrow. All the best.